Oh boy. The things I do for you guys. So it turns out that like GTA 4, Skyrim also has a Frozen mod. And seeing as my last video about Frozen was so popular, I'm going to go ahead and make another. So as you can probably expect, this mod is a bit more complex than the one for GTA 4. You actually need to travel west of Windhelm to find a small church-like building in the snow. Inside you can find two frost antronaches guarding Elsa, similar to the monster in the movie. So this is pretty cool because Elsa is actually a full-fledged follower. As you can expect, she fights using ice magic and is actually fairly powerful in combat as you can see here. If I were to play through Skyrim again, I actually might consider having her on my journey. As with many other mods, I could see plenty of ways to improve this one. For example, it could have a better face for Elsa just because the current one kinda creeps me out. Secondly, it'd be nice if she had some sort of storyline. I get that it'd be hard to implement an actual voice for her, but you could use some lines directly from the movie or something. So that's pretty much it. While it was more than just a simple reskin, it was still pretty empty in terms of what it actually consisted of. Either way, I'd still recommend this mod to anyone who just wants to mess around for a while. It's also good for those who want an Ice Mage follower, but don't really want to spend the time to find one on their own in Skyrim. Anyways guys, that is all for today, so I'll see you all later, and have a good day. Oh